We are Charles and Deborah, two workaholics who gave up our desert homestead for a retirement abroad in Panama. Join us for our adventure. Hey friends and family, welcome back. Just wanted to let you know that the last month has been a whirlwind of activity and quite frankly, I didn't get to post near as many videos about all the interesting things we were doing, but it's kind of a, a decision. Do I enjoy the moment or do I capture the video? And as much as I want to be able to put up a video about everything we do, this month, this past month, it just wasn't possible. And so I hope you can forgive me for that. Especially you, Mom. Yes, we're still okay, and yes, we're doing well. One of the really good things about the last month um, is that we got our driver's licenses. Now, I will tell you, we did not plan on driving here. We did not plan on getting a car. But the area we chose necessitated it. If we had moved to a place like Panama City or David or near larger metropolitan areas in Panama, we may have been able to use the public transit system. But we chose a more isolated area of the Azuero and really and truly if we wanted to be able to get out and do the things necessary to live on a day to day, we needed to get a car. And so that's what our prior video was about. We got a car, we got our driver's licenses. More than that, we were able to get our Panamanian ID number, which is called a cedula. And because we are foreigners or extranjeros, ours is an e cedula. And so we got our e cedula. I'm very happy about that. Of course, when I say it really fast and I'm not trying to say it correctly, it's an e cedula. But for this purpose, we are officially recognized as residents of Panama still maintaining our American citizenship. I had that question posed in an email uh, comment, a private comment to one of our other videos. We are still American citizens. We still retain all rights and responsibilities of being American citizens. However, we've chosen to retire abroad. And so it's just a different way of retiring. And we're really enjoying it. Charles is preparing to head back to the United States for a little bit. He's got to take care of some business and I'll stay here and hold down the fort. And, and until I can get a series of videos together, uh, more about the daily living here and some of the other things we're doing, enjoy this compilation.
Hey friends and family, we're wrapping up our Valle de Anton night. Um, we took a date night after dropping off Lisa and we came up to Valle de Anton and just wanted to kind of see the sights and catch a restaurant that we heard was really good and it was. Um, we'll show some more footage but oh my gosh from this point we can actually see one of the oceans and it's just pretty amazing how high up we are and the view. And Charles? Hello. <laughs> we don't get to see too much of Charles because he's always off doing everything or taking the footage for us. So we'll go ahead and get going and I'll talk to you later. If you'd like to follow us, um, please click subscribe and hit the little notification bell and you'll be notified whenever new videos come out. Talk to you later.